Now, we all know you for your fabulous insults. What I want to know is when you're doing stand-up, is anyone in the audience brave enough to sort of heckle you back? Oh, of course, and I, I welcome it, because if they pay for it, you know, why not come in and deal with it? But I must tell you, though, I'm quite excited to be here, and it's insane to come on here after the drought, after the snake killer, and finding out that Belinda Carlisle is a spiritual bottom. I mean, this is an uplifting show here. You've got everything covered, really. And the good thing about having a spiritual bottom means they're really holy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, look, I'm good. I You're mean, good? I'm better now you brought up the spiritual bottom <laughs> thing. It's true. Because, yeah. uh, you know, before today, <laughs> the show only had one spiritual bottom, and that was Hamish. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God! This is nice, nice, <laughs> nice having you. Yeah. Um, no. Bianca, do you think you can get away with so much because of all of this? No, I think that it's important to. You mean, well, I mean, obviously, this is the packaging to get away with murder. Because if I don't wear this, they just say, "Oh, what a nasty gay person!" And then <laughs> you put this on, and I go, "It's hysterical." So it does fool people, but I'm the same out of this. You know what I mean? And I, people often ask me, you know, how do you get to this point? How do you look this glamorous every day? I mean, what's your beauty regimen? And I go, you know, well, the interesting thing is that I wake up like this. Usually, <laughs> after I pass out like this from the night before. So it's a theme that I have going on. Your you know, eyes are off the charts. One's glass. One's glass. One's glass? Yeah, look at me. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. <laughs> It's not actually, no. I'm, I'm feeling a lot of emotions. <laughs> yeah, it's called an erection. Okay. <laughs> it happened. It happened. I have that effect on men. <laughs> <laughs> Should we jump uh, in or you guys? No, jump in, jump in, please. No, no, me. I'm just going to sit with my emotion. <laughs> <laughs> and, you, and you ask a question. Ask a question. Listen. To be fair, I aroused your snake and you tried to kill one earlier. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, wait. The producers um, say he did not try. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. He did not try to kill a snake. Yeah. That's weird. Yeah. I was getting a different voice. <laughs> yeah, okay. I don't even have an earpiece. <laughs> now, on Drag Race, you beat our very own Courtney Act, but you guys are, are friends in real life, right? Oh, completely. No, when I first went into Drag Race and I saw Courtney, I was like, oh, it's over. You know, I thought she had it in the bag. But what was great is that through the experience that we became really, really good friends. And usually opposites attract because I'm gorgeous and she's not. And what <laughs> <laughs> wasn't a joke. But uh, no, we did become really good friends. And it's an amazing opportunity. And I think in fairness, I mean, aside from winning and having to get to work all over the world, it's been unbelievable just to become friends with everybody, you know, because we all do like each other. Your style of comedy really reminds me of Joan Rivers. And you are well, you were also friends with Joan Rivers. Yes, she was lovely. Now she's dead. But uh, no, she would laugh, but she's dead. No, um, what did she teach you about performing? No, she was absolutely amazing. And I got to do this brilliant show with her called uh, In Bed with Joan Rivers. And I was so excited when it was done, not because I was with Joan Rivers, but I could go back and tell my dad, whoa, I got in bed with a woman. I'm a killer. But it's... Hang on, sorry. My emotions are coming back. No, they are. Okay. <laughs> Let me reach lower. No, it was... <laughs> Actually, I didn't have to reach that far. I was, it ain't that much. I was say, you, don't, you don't have to reach too uh, yeah. <laughs> uh No, but it was God. amazing. She, she was really, really lovely. And it was a great opportunity to be there with somebody that we, who I thought was immensely genius and also so funny and so, for, you know, so kind to other people. Because when you're that funny, you don't have to be nice. And Take you, a note. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, we're... Uh -huh, uh, uh -huh. Yep, got it. Yeah. Um, how are you playing Wem Wembley Stadium? That is incredible. Yeah, I'm quite excited. Can yes. I, can I be your support act? Of course, we'll work it out. Okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> Sorted. Done deal. Uh, well, Bianca is touring around the country with her show, Just a Joke. Head to our website for details. Would you please put your hands together for Bianca Del Rio?